Today is a bright, cheery October fall day here at the Lanesville Community Center. Christine Drohan and myself, Sandy Burton, are doing this memorial photography video shoot at the VLB Writing Cottage, which is on the land of the Lanesville Community Center in Lanesville, Mass. Christine will read a little story before life story. Welcome to our two-year anniversary of the Virginia Lee Burton Writing Cottage here at the Lanesville Community Center. This small building celebrates the month of October with much of its history. This building was built for Virginia Lee Burton in 1963 at the end of Folly Point Road in Folly Cove, Massachusetts. In 2002, the property was sold with the little building on it. Virginia Lee Burton visited this building often every week until her death in 1968. In 2002, Sandy, Sandy Burton, made a request in writing to the new owner of the property to be allowed to remove the little building if it was not to be used or would be torn down by the owner. Sandy also relayed that message to the on-site building crews and checked in quarterly with them. In September of 2009, Sandy received a call in California where he was living that the building would be demolished in two weeks if it wasn't able, if he wasn't able to remove it. The construction crew informed him that extensive excavation had been conducted over the last few years, but they would assist him in removal from the site with a large excavator. Sandy flew back from California and moved the little building in pieces in the week of October 15, 2009, onto his property in Lanesville Folly Cove and shrink-wrapped the disassembled building. In 2013, Sandy returned to Lanesville from living in California and began the search for the new site for the building. In the fall of 2017, a request was made by the LCC board to the Gloucester Historic Commission for their support in the group being awarded a CPA grant in the city of Gloucester for $50,000 with an estimated cost of $75,000 for reconstruction and restoration. An architect on the Historic Commission questioned the ability to complete the project at the price of $35,000 commitment. The group reassured them that a search out for additional funds would be conducted if necessary. At the end of October 2017, the CPA Committee of the Gloucester City Council granted and we received funding approval in December of 2017 for the 2018 calendar year. In 2017, volunteers and some paid assistants lovingly reassembled and erected the writing cottage as it sits today. A total of 23 volunteers assisted in the many aspects of the rebuild and restoration. On the week of October 15, 2017, which coincided with the near 50-year anniversary of Virginia Lee Burton's passing, we celebrated a dedication of this building. The following week, Virginia Lee Burton's son and daughter-in-law celebrated by reading one of Ginny's books, Little House, right here at the LCC. The history of this little building became the real-life family values commitment script. The foundation footprint was dug by Marianne, a real life and still used tractor. The steel foundation was fabricated and donated by Virginia Lee Burton's grandson from Barry, Vermont. Siding of the cottage, which required replacement, was milled by local artisan here in Lanesville. And the painting of the exterior was completed by another local artist. The wheelchair access ramp was built by a local contractor here in Lanesville. For the past two years, the cottage has been used for community reading programs, art projects, and also as a location for a nas uh, national reading program, including tutoring for local students. 
please um, stay with us and enjoy a reading of Life Story, a, an incredible book by Virginia Lee Barton, and it was her last published book.